Give me a draw, Getty. Too slow, bud. Yeah. This is better when you don't suck. It is better when you don't suck. Give me one more. Good. Now, work your way back to the holster. Get your flashlight out. Now give me a draw. There's a difference, because we have a flashlight. So we talk about the phone all the time, but the flashlight's an issue too. Why would I use a flashlight? To see. To see is good. All right, now most gunfights, they don't happen in dark, dark, but this is a tool of deselection. Who carries a flashlight? Police. Yeah. And the police. All right, so you come down and you're doing this, it may be the dissuader. All right, well, they got a flashlight. Yeah. What else does it broadcast? That's 12. See? That, that broadcasts my intent and my awareness to see what's ahead of me. So it's important. But what if my fight started and I need to use this flashlight for some reason? Okay? There are a lot of techniques. I'm going to recommend the easiest one because this is an easy class. Two techniques. All right? Put it next to your eyes and turn your head and point it wherever you want to. Sorry, man. Yeah, I got you twice. Okay? If I were to use cover, like this bag, and I put it here, and for some reason I had to come out around this side. The bag takes most of the light. So simply switch the flashlight to the other side so you can see what it's doing. If I came out this side, I could go over here. So it just nullifies that silly conversation about cover. Okay? Let's do this. Pretty simple. Okay? So what I would like you to now do is to get your flashlight up and practice these things. Because we have a flashlight, we're going to be able to go at extension, but we're going to do one-handed shooting. How many of you shoot one-handed often? All right. It's really good for you. It really helps your fundamentals, but it's no fun. How many of you shoot with the other hand? Yeah, that really... hand. Wow. Thank you, Dr. Archer. Master's degree, GED. Yeah. <laughs> All right. 